Hey guys, this is my second Wi-Fi battle against Darren, aka Tsehernzer. Uh, I'll have his YouTube channel posted below. Um, so I lead with a my CB Tyranitar, and he leads with some sort of Mag Mortar. He switches out, fearing the Stone Edge, into a Melotic. And I'd use the Stone Edge. I miss, however, so that's just kind of bad. Uh, it's only 20% chance of that happening. So, um, I switch out to my Empoleon. I know that he can wall any my low tick. Uh, he's done it before. He can do it again. Um, so, I get off the agility, and he withdraws the, um, he withdraws the, the, my low tick, fearing some sort of grass knot off the top. But, um, instead I just used agility, got the speed up. And I knew that I could probably just attack here or try to switch out and survive. I say, uh, screw it, I have nothing else to switch into that can directly wall this, and I want to keep the shuckle hidden. So I go off for the attack. It doesn't kill, um, but I get enough damage out that uh, I'll be able to outstall that Electivire to death uh, shortly. Uh, you'll see that. So he takes me out with one Earthquake, um, which is... Kind of what I expected, uh, that or an electric attack, and if he did an electric attack, I knew that I'd be able to switch into the shuckle to wallet, but uh, then again, I wanted to hide the shuckle. Anyways, I send the shuckle in, and um, I'm just going to protect to get some sandstorm damage off of that electivire. And the electivire, um, I switch into, I'd seen the, uh, from the first protect, seeing that he used earthquake, I switch into the skarmory, and the skarmory uh, is completely resistant to the earthquake, so now the second um, sandstorm takes out the electivire. And uh, Dragonite comes out. I know this Dragonite's running some sort of thunder or electric attack. So I just go for one layer of spikes. I'm confident with my uh, Skarmory special defense to survive this. So he survives with uh, 111 HP. And he gets the spikes. Um, the Sandstorm is raging. I know that I could probably go for a second layer of spikes. But I'm clearly not going to make it because I'm not fast enough. So I see this thunder coming out again. So I switch into my Shuckle. Now Shuckle is the king... He's th he's the king of all walls. Now, um, prepare yourself for what you're about to see. So the shuckle comes out, the sandstorm rages, and, um, he starts doing protect. He, uh, doesn't exactly want to face the shuckle yet, so he switches out into his water Pokemon, thinking his water, Melo his Melotic, can take out a shuckle. Now, here is where he got it so wrong. But, um, I do make up for it here. I believe he misses with a Hydra Pump. Um... Yes, he misses with a Hydro Pump, and I get the Toxic off. So, the, missing with the Hydro Pump kind of made up for me missing with the Stone Edge against the Melodic in the beginning. So, it's all fair. Um, and I get the Toxic off, and then I protect um, for some more Sandstorm damage. He gets off his first Surf right around here. Oh, yeah, there's just so much stalling. Okay, so the Surf comes out, and it brings me... It takes about 30 to 40% of my HP. Um, but... I'm fine with that, so um, I wall it off next turn, and did I set up Stealth Rocks? Yes, I did. I set up Stealth Rocks, and now um, I know that the next turn uh, I'll be able to protect, and his Melodic will be out of here. Um, yes, I protect the Hydro Pump, and his Melodic is gone. So I've officially walled a Water type with a Rock type. And um, my enemy is going to switch into Magmortar because he has nothing really better to take out this Shuckle. Um, wasn't exactly the best choice. Now here's where he makes big mistakes. Um, he uses a two-turn attack against something with Protect. That is that is just a no-go. You do not do that. Um, so I get the Toxic off. Next turn I just Protect these... Uh, these... What, what's it called? Um, I Protect the... Solar Beam, there you go. I'm forgetting the attacks. What am I doing? Okay, so I wall the Solar Beam um, by protecting it, and then this Magmortar isn't going to get very far. He sees that if he does that again, he's just going to get totally walled. He Fire Blasts. It's not going to take too much damage. Um, Shuckle, especially during Sandstorm. King of Special Defense. So he only gets brought down to about half. And um, he, he protects next turn. That Magmortar's done. <sighs> You can see the shuckle is just de demolishing my enemies right now. Um, so next he switches out into his... What is he going to switch out into? Um, I don't recall. Let's see. Yes, he switches out into his Togekiss. Now, I was I predicted this would be some sort of flinch Togekiss. 
So I knew that Shuckle was my best attempt at this because I have a Protect and I got a Toxic. Two counters to the Flinch Togekiss. But, so I get the Toxic up and he starts another two-turn attack. He didn't learn anything from the first one. It was just really bad. Um, so I Protect the next turn and he's like, oh no, I can't fight this. Um, so that would have been a good attack. I would have dealt some serious damage because it's neutral against Shuckle, but um, too bad. You used a two-turn attack. Didn't do anything to me. So he, this is funny. He uses a metronome and he gets a roar off and sends this Shuckle out of here and he drags out my Skarmory. Um, this is fine for me though because I see some sort of like fighting attack, fighting maybe Aura Sphere coming from this Togekiss. It's pretty standard on a Togekiss. So um, I know that I can just, well, I, I, if I can stall this for one more turn, the Toxic's gonna take him out. So uh, he uses Aura Sphere. I wall with a Roost. Um, I'm totally fine. And his Togekiss goes down. Now what is he switching to? Um, I believe it is his Dragonite. Is that his last Pokemon? Don't remember. Yes, his Dragonite comes out. Um, at this point, I see another Thunder coming, so Shuckle it is. And works perfectly. Does he hit me with the Thunder? It doesn't really matter. The Shuckle would have walled it, and the Shuckle is king. I probably would have been able to pull off a rest, and it's practically the end of the game. So, um, right before I kill his dragon, I he calls it quits, and he is done. He blizzards, whatever, it doesn't do much. Toxic gets off on the Dragonite, and a couple more, more turns of stalling, and the Dragonite will be dead. His last Pokemon's out of here. So, he doesn't take that, and he flees somewhere up here. But anyways, that's game, guys. Uh, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, like it, etc. You know what I mean. Okay, um, bye. This has been a 5v5 match in my second Wi-Fi battle. I'm currently accepting challenges.